morning good morning good morning and welcome back to thick chick vlogs honey hello sweetheart if you are new here i am your host nitra aka sugar mama yeah how you doing darling welcome 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 to the family before you leave i hope that you hit that subscribe button because you enjoyed what you saw today you get to come along with me i work with children with autism but honey what we do is, is we do it up we have fashion we do trail honey we just be in them streets we do but we have a lot of fun doing it so i hope that you enjoy make sure you get you a nice wonderful beverage a snack at a snack and enjoy the show y'all i really hope you enjoyed this week i'm still working on my patio i'm going to be doing my reveal soon i'm just excited so let's go ahead and jump into it i ain't gonna keep y'all long but know that god loves you and i do too so let's go y'all well welcome honey as i said this is a new week in the vlog today we are going to be doing a mini thrift which is what i always do on thursdays if you are new here i'm going to go to one of my favorite goodwills that it's over by my baby job and instead of just sitting in the car waiting on her or waiting for an hour doing nothing i'm going to be productive so we're going to go get some footage and see what they have to offer up in the good off up in there i know they always have something i found a table that i'm not too mm, about but it's cute it'll do for now till i find the exact table that i want but this is the outfit of the day the hair is still hairing them clippings are still clipping baby mm -hmm. they get bigger and bigger every day yeah yeah so i love them and my bantu knots are still holding up praise the lord mm -hmm. yeah I, I got a lot of secrets tied up in them there bantus that's what they for mm -hmm. so i have my anime t-shirt i don't know um this person i just love the color my baby made me buy it and i just threw on the same color or that are in here that dark teal green threw on some pocketed leggings of course y'all know i love a good pocket legging and threw on some teal jordans and this is the fit for today so we're gonna do a lot of thrifting and we're going to probably one of the farms today because it is finally absolutely gorgeous outside but i hope you guys enjoy hope you enjoyed this particular vlog because we're moving to shaking honey i've been working y'all see these bags under my i need to get some sleep pray for me i do i'm gonna get some rest though today mm -hmm. when i come home today i ain't even going in the backyard because if i go back there i'm gonna get to doing something so i'm gonna sit my high pots down somewhere relax edit and get my last vlog on out so i hope you guys have been enjoying the vlogs but leave me a comment let me know if you are new here welcome sugar we love you and if you are not honey i love you and i so thank god for you so let's go have some fun today honey let's invite the lord into our day and let him take over and have control total control but we give him total praise come on y'all <laughs> all right y'all we're going to do something a little bit different today there's a few things i need to get to rewire my patio for my projector screen and then i found this really cute outdoor rug i can put under my table so we're going to go at five below and then i may run into home depot to see what else um other things that i need but let's go here and get this stuff done instead of going to dig in the same thrift store um, i show you guys that anyway and i'm going to be going thrifting all day tomorrow 
I'm gonna go ahead and get what I need today. So bear with me. Come on and enjoy. Let's go see what they got in five below. And then if I have time, I'm gonna run a to Home Depot and get the what I need to hang my curtains. So come on. Mm -hmm. Yo, one of these days, it's gonna come back to get you. Cause you've been lying, cheating, all of your life you've been stealing. One day, you go gonna change your ways. Oh, you've been lying, lying cheating, all of your life you've been stealing. One day, you're gonna change your ways. Oh, you've been lying. All right, we're doing something a little different today. We are going to be at our DAV thrift. We usually come on Wednesdays, but since we had to go do a couple of different errands today, we're over here at the farm. So we're gonna run in here and see what they got, what they given today. This table is gorgeous. Let me go look at this table and see how I can see this table. Hold on. This table is beautiful. Boy, 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 if you can't furnish your stuff in the thrift store, honey, you, you're doing something wrong. Oh, I like these. I can put these on my porch. $14. Is that $14 each? Okay. Let me go find out. Perfect, but I can't do 75, baby. And I, I should have came on Wednesday. Okay, can I? This is cute. 
Let me get me a basket real quick. Let's get us a little basket. Hey, honey. Good. How you feeling? I'm doing the same thing. You go to go. Maybe this one down is six dollars. I was like, I could probably never, and I went ahead and tried them on. Oh, wow, look yeah, at these. So. Nope. You never I, know until you try them on, you know. Yeah, I, <clears throat> nope. I've never been able to balance myself in heels. I look like the Wizard of Oz, <laughs> the Tin yeah. Man. I'm like, or the Scarecrow. Oh, God, these are cute. Yeah. Only $5. These are good. All right. Ten dollars. Yeah. I don't need him anymore. You know, so I mean, if he's got a two, three hundred dollar jacket, you know, that he wants to sell. Yes, online, absolutely. You know? Oh like, God. Go ahead, like.
it's on the left one, right? Maybe. So you doing all right? Yes, sweetheart. How are you today? I know that's right. Uh-uh. Um, Rob showed up. Okay. Um, yeah. Rob came in late. I thought I was going to go back here. Good morning, good morning, good morning, you guys. I love you this morning. Today is Friday. Today is my usual thrifting day in the vlog. If you are new here, honey, Friday is my usually my big thrift day. But today we're going to do something a little bit different. Um, I'm still working on the patio. I know I've been saying that for a minute, but I'm trying to take my time and do it right. I want to be able to show you guys in steps as I'm doing it. So I hope you're enjoying the process, but I need to go to Home Depot to get um, some materials so I can hang my curtains the way I want to hang them. Um, so they're more flowy and, and not just staple to um, the wood out there. So I'm just going to take you guys with me today to get the material and then I'm going to come back and do some more work on the patio instead of going thrifting. Um, I just want to switch it up a little bit. Hope y'all don't mind. Uh, y'all have seen a million and one thrifts with me. So um, if I get a chance, I may run in and do a little bit or I may go to Uptown Cheapskate. But I really want to focus on this patio so I can knock this out and get it out of the way so we can get back to our regularly scheduled program. So, but I really do hope you guys enjoy today. Like I said, we just run into Home Depot. I'm going to go to, we're going to the gym, of course. Y'all know I got to get my steps in and my workout. So we're going to do that. And then we're going to go to Home Depot, probably grab some lunch after and then come back and, and get get cracking because it, it looks just a hot mess. It seems like every time I get one project done, another one piles up. So I, I'm taking my time versus wearing myself out and then being exhausted and crazy looking plus i want to redo my hair this weekend i don't know what i want to do i may leave it like this because i can't think of um i hate rushing anything so i don't want to rush a hairstyle but i really have i really want to change this one because i love this one but y'all know i don't have a hairstyle in but two weeks maybe three and then i'm antsy for another one so i'm getting at that point where i'm antsy for another one but i like this one and it's so simple and easy when I'm doing this project. So I may leave this like this until at least probably next weekend. But y'all going to see in the video. You will see it. If I come back, honey, and the, and the, and the, and the do is done different. Did y'all know I was just on? I couldn't do it. I can't sit still. So I love y'all. Hope you enjoy today. But yeah, just want to do something a little bit different. You know with the channel. So, hope you enjoy. Love y'all. Here go the outfit of the day. 
All right, of course, this is when I, yeah, this is when that hair is like, just one more week, one more to do, because the bigger it get, the, I mean, the older it gets, the prettier it is, and I'm just a fan of big hair, don't care, I love it, because um, I just, my, I have an oval shaped face, so when I wear my hair big, it just looks, I look like a lioness, it, it yes, I love it. And I just threw on this California uh, Republic t-shirt that I got from, I think I got this from Dee Dee's a while ago. In one of the videos a, a while ago, um, we went over to Dee Dee's. And for Dee Dee's, that's a treat for me because that's like an hour away from me. But we happened to be on that side of town um, of Hampton Roads. And so I went ahead and stopped in Dee Dee's. I don't know why there is only that one Dee Dee's. I wish there was one on our side. We call it the side of the water, but we don't. So when I found this shirt, it was only like $2.99. And I just, I stocked up on t-shirts when I was over there. Um, but threw that one on. And of course, you know, I chopped it up and made it more feminine because it was a men's t-shirt. Um, that square shape. Um, if you guys would like another tutorial, you know, I don't mind doing my tutorials. Um, just let me know, but if you are new here and you have not seen my t-shirt tutorials, leave me a comment or you can go back and watch one of the videos I've already done, but I would definitely do another one if you need it, but threw on, of course, my pocket favorite type of leggings, and this time I threw on my checkerboard um, Converse because there is brown in the bear, so I didn't want to put on all red shoes and go monochromatic today, so we went ahead and went with the the Converse, the Chucks. Oh, Chuck. What the Chuck? Okay. So, hope you enjoy the outfit. I'm still trying to make my hair bigger, y'all. I know it ain't for everybody. I know. But it's for me. So, let's go have fun today. Let's go joy. That's the day. That's the name of the day, Joy. Let's go get it. And love on your husband. Oh Lord, do y'all hear that mess? He's starting again this morning. Look at him. Okay, hold on. Show the remote. Look, look. Look at the white shoes. Look at the white shoes. Okay, listen. It's them fly RBKs. I paid nineteen dollars for them at Burlington Co. Factory. Look at the color though. And I got a pair of blue ones. You ain't got to spend a lot of money to be fly. He, somebody trying to get in on uh yeah, the yeah. outfit of the day. You see yeah. him trying to do his outfit of the day, y'all. Yeah. Now let's go have some fun. Uh, I didn't sign a disclosure form. <laughs> yeah, y'all, we are out and about running errands. So today, like I said, we're gonna run a few errands. Um, but we are in the vicinity vicinity of Burlington, right behind me. And I'm about to go in. We're just going to see what they got on the way to. Um, we needed to go to Burlington, but I don't really like Burlington. So I'm going to go next door to Ross. So if I find something good, I'll let you guys know. But let's go see, honey. Yes, these are supposed to be um, Doc Martens. All right, let's see what else we see. There's a black pair. $19. Y'all, I like these so much. Oh, look at that. $49. Oh, they're heavy. Mm -mm. No, ma'am. This shoe is so heavy. Good gracious, that shoe is heavy. Oh, the single ladies. Oh, the single ladies. <laughs> Go ahead, girl. Now, th now, these are fabulous. I wish they were platform. Cute, though. Twenty-six dollars. Mm -hmm. Ross used to be hitting. They ain't hitting on nothing right now. 
That is not cute. Now these are fabulous. Platform, $39. Yeah. They lucky I don't need these because I like them. But now that I know that they have them, I might come back and get them. I like high top though. Yeah, Doc Martin's in Ross. If you are in need, oh snap. Okay. Okay, this is the second pair I done seen. I don't need to buy these shoes. But I like these. But I like these. Let me know in the comment section which pair you like better. The black and the white or the white and the black? Which pair should I come back and get? More Doc Martens? Hey y'all, I'm home. I took a really good nap today. Excuse me. This is how I wrap my hair up at night and when I'm working. Uh, I just, like I said, we went to, I hope you enjoyed the um, Ross. We went into Ross and I found, oh, oh, I'll show you guys in a little while, but I found a couple of things that I'm going to show you, but we're going to do that DIY either later or tomorrow. But right now I wanted to chime in really quick to say hey girl how you doing hey y'all um but i'm doing a diy but i wanted to show you what i found at five below five below if you are in the mood or you just are one of the people like me who loves gadgets five below has this new um speaker and because i'm changing all of the the decor out there to either black white gold or some form of neutral went in five below and they had this gorgeous sound top table now this is a wireless table it is a literally a table but it is a speaker so it is a bluetooth speaker Okay, so I got the color black. They also had this natural type. It was kind of lighter than this box, but there is a natural color if you wanted a more natural tone. But I didn't want to do natural because it was too, it was like a more yellowish natural. If you know what I'm talking about, that oak color. And that was too light for my particular color of wood. So I got black. Now this was not $5 it was 25 so if you probably have already seen in i would say i think this i think it's in this video i went to five below because i was looking for auxiliary cords you know cords newer cords to um put back there that are longer the cords i have were short because i did not need long because of where i had the placement of my electronics 
but because I'm moving them, I'm going to sit them on this table. I was looking for a cute little inexpensive table and ended up finding this table. And like I said, it is a wireless speaker table. So I'm going to put it together really quick and I'll show it kind of me putting it together, see how easy it was to put together. I'll hook it up, get you guys, keep you guys posted. And then I'm going to go in the back and play in the backyard and listen to music with it to kind of see how it works so I can let you guys give just a quick review on it, whether it's worth buying or not. But it was $25, like I said. I thought that was a little much, but I needed a table and I needed a speaker. So it was just like, if I go to Best Buy, if I go to Amazon, I'm going to pay at least 40 bucks for a speaker and then i had to buy a table anyway so it for me it panned out if you are somebody who just loves gadgets and 25 is not a lot to you or if you just need a little table and a speaker like i did and you want to save a little change then you go ahead and get this but i'm going to test it out put it together you'll see me putting it together a little bit test it out tonight and then tomorrow before we start our diy the rest of it back there I'll let you guys know how this thing works, but it's made by a brand called Ooh, Bass Jacks. B A S S J A X X. Bass Jacks. Um, but it plays the radio. You can do FM AM mode or FM mode, Bluetooth, and it has a battery. So I guess you can plug this thing in. Um, okay. All right, so we're about to see y'all. Let's see what they're hitting for, and then I'll let you guys know. But you will see me put it together a little bit, and I will at the end tell you how easy. Um, tomorrow, I'll tell you how easy it was and work if it's worth it and the sound quality. So, and you probably will get to see where I place it. So, let's go ahead and get started. And it was easy with the place. We got the flash card from the Federal Credit Union. I can't imagine where they do. They have the best vacation. Look at all those fish. Okay, all I'm doing is adding the little grips. I think this took, I think this literally took less than five minutes. <laughs> this is dope. That's it. Wow. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. <laughs> Y'all, I literally just turned the camera off, put it in fast motion, thinking it was going to take me at least 15, 15 minutes, something like that. The only thing came, excuse me, the only thing came in the box were was the tabletop um and three legs they had the bottom part which is what i just showed you at the end the stickies that you put on the bottom the slip guards and the directions um they gave me two different instruction manuals so this is the wire if you want to charge it up or um just use it as a table it's just up to you um but it is wireless so i'm going to go outside now work on a project and we're going to listen to this to see now this speaker is only or the table is only 14 inches wide so this is not this is just like a side table or a small table if you have like if you want to put a plant the phone your phone something a, a, a couple of, of glasses if you have people coming to visit this is not a table table this is a side table or an end table but I just needed something for the middle of, I have two chairs and I wanted to have some form of a table for people to sit and put their drinks on. So I have coasters already. So I'm pretty sure once I put the coasters on there, I won't mind if people put drinks or what have you, but it is plastic. It is not, um, or yeah, this seems to be, and this whole thing, the whole outer rim is the speaker so we're gonna see how loud it is um but i literally thought it was gonna take at least don't know why i think i thought it was gonna take at least 15 minutes took me less than two really less than two minutes all you're doing is screwing the legs in and 
we ready so let's go see um but look how big well i won't say how big it's big for a speaker but like i said it's only 14 inches around if that is your jam if that is what you are looking for i would so far but let's go see what it sounds like and how it reacts to the wi-fi so i'll see you guys in a second i was gonna wait and do like a re it took me two minutes y'all so if that i will give it a 10 out of 10 for um accessibility and directions there really was none you just screw these in and you're done so let's go plug it up work on some projects listen to some music and then in the morning i don't want to keep stopping to do a review so i'll do one in the morning uh but please know i'm gonna be looking crazy because i'm working hard and i love you but i love you i do so i hope you guys have been enjoying the um the vlog but let's go get it cracking let's go do some work i uh, i made sure i took me a nap because i knew i was going to be doing all of this i did a lot already today so i'm listening to my body so i'm starting to make sure i rest in between things so let's go ahead and have some fun outside playing outside in the backyard come on y'all y'all know how it is when y'all used to go outside play in the backyard how many of y'all used to do that oh i love being outside so let's go some people don't like being outside i'm an outside girl i love being outside on the porch that is why i put so much emphasis and time back there because i just love it i just love it because god is back there he outside y'all he in here too but it's peace you can hear the birds you can hear the animals you it's just so and the fresh air baby ain't nothing like ain't nothing like the breath of the lord that fresh air baby is good so let's go get some of it and i'll see you guys out there come on uh by the way y'all know y'all to be ashamed of yourself for not coming to help me now y'all gonna have y'all feet up here back here eating snacks and watching movies and stuff with me and y'all go ahead and get your person come on meet me back here i'm tired doing all this by myself i'm yeah i'm gonna be waiting for y'all i'm gonna be waiting come come on come on Coming along, y'all. Coming along. All right, so now I am turning this basket um, that I found at Ross. I showed you guys at Ross. I'm going to use it as a lampshade for my light. And I just painted this orange. It used to be orange, and I just sprayed it black. So this is going to sit. It's upside. I need to sit it upside down. And then that's going to sit as like a lampshade. So I will show you guys tomorrow once we get it um, hanging. I just wanted it to dry for tonight. Um, but it's just a simple basket that we're turning into a lampshade. Like I said, this is an outdoor lamp. It's battery operated. So once I get it all painted, then I'll be able to... Well, once it dries, it's all painted. So once we hang it and get everything going, I will be able to show you guys. But I can't wait to see how it turns out. I hope it don't look too crazy. But we'll see. Love you. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Um, I just woke up. I slept in late. So, of course, today is Saturday. It's a new day in the vlog. If you are new here welcome saturdays are my diy mornings um but i always sleep in and get my rest or try to so this weekend i did just that so i just got up a little while ago and i'm about to make me some peanut butter and jelly and i have this skinny sandwich bread um whole wheat and they're very well not very healthy but they're healthier option of bread um and I have some natural crunchy I love crunchy peanut butter girl put in who who else love crunchy peanut butter it's low in sodium uh seven grams of protein so this is by Jif praise the lord um I didn't want any oatmeal. I try not to eat oatmeal on the weekends because I eat it Monday through Friday. And of course, my favorite elderberry jelly. Honey, I need to do a cup. 
Girl, if I would have dropped that, I would have cried. Something terrible. This is my favorite jelly in the world. You guys know when I go to the farm, see the farm I go to? This is fresh handmade jelly. And it's elderberry, so it's good for you. You know how you have elderberry? Um, elderberries are good for you in general, but theirs is um, made with natural sweetened, just the straight elderberry. Um, there is, uh, it's called mountpleasantfarms.com. So you might be able to go on there and see if you can find, if they ship. But this, y'all, is the best jelly I've ever had in my life. I love grape jelly. If you are a grape jelly fan, <sighs> this is so good. This is so good. And it's, uh, I don't know, I can't describe, I can't really describe it, but it's, it's just made with elderberry, honey, and juice, lemon juice. I mean, it's just good. It's really good. So, uh, if you get a chance, like I said, it's called Mount Pleasant Farms. It's the same farm I go to when I show you guys the girls and I with the goats. And we just sit out there and relax. And I I love the owner. The own, I met the owner years ago, so we are really, really cool. Um, but if you have any questions, just leave them in the comment section. But I'm going to eat me some cantaloupe. Where's my cantaloupe? Let me get my cantaloupe. It's kind of scary. People are going pretty fast. I like to eat the or buy the ones that come cubed already because they're only three dollars it's all cut up for you so I'm gonna have some cantaloupe and some uh, and a peanut butter and jelly sandwich and then we're gonna go in the backyard and we're gonna get it cracking I got my curtains to put up today it's raining it's gonna rain all day um, I have to I'm not going to do too much in the backyard today because I still have a whole nother week to finish my reveal. I'm praying, God willing, I can finish everything next weekend. Um, but today we're going to do, I'm going to do a, a quick little cute haul um, of some pieces I found while thrifting this week. I'm just going to do a little bit out there and then I have to get everything ready for my haul tonight. Clean my YouTube room and... Just a lot, a lot of little things. So y'all come on, let's enjoy this day. I hope you're having a good day today. And make sure you eat breakfast. I know you don't want to, but eat breakfast. Breakfast is good for you. And let me know if you need me. Okay, I'll see y'all in a little bit. Y'all, I'm tired. It has been a, quite a few hours since the last time you guys saw me talking on here this morning. I went out, ate breakfast, <laughs> and immediately got started on the patio. I'm still, I'm pretty much 80% done. I still have to put up my curtains and arrange a couple more like areas that I want to, you know, you know how you go out there, um, when you go out somewhere and you do something new to something, you kind of view it and see if that's where you want the placement to be. So I'm in that realm. Once I put the curtains up, I'll have a better sense of, is that where I want certain items to be placed? And I need to go get a couple of decorative baskets this week. Um, while I'm thrifting, I need to find a couple of decorative baskets because I have um, my own tools and um, you know, like my screwdrivers, my um, hot glue gun, things like that that I like to store back there. I need to get some that match the patio scheme now. So um, just finished, I'm going to take a shower, get dressed. It's time for date night because I look a hot, when I say a hot mess and I bust myself in the head, girl. I was working hard today. Oh shit! Ooh, I scratched myself, but oh forgive me, <clears throat> y'all. Excuse me. I was working hard. I bust myself in the head. It's time for me to go sit down, eat some dinner, and relax. And actually, I'm going to be recording tonight, so I'm going to be doing a quick, a really simple, quick, cute haul. Um, for this week because I still need at least another week to get everything the way i want it um before i show you guys the patio i would have shown it today but it would have been half done 
And I know y'all don't want to see it half done because I wouldn't want to see it half done. So I've been working hard, but I love y'all and I'm so grateful y'all giving me grace to do this this way. But I hope you enjoyed the haul. So make sure you, if you haven't, go back and check out my little cute um, haul for Sunday. Um, but we're going to go on a date night. So I'll show you guys when I come back the outfit of the day and then we're going to get out of here. Because y'all know, did y'all know Red Lobster is going out of business? Do y'all know we go? That's one of our spots. So um, we're going to go there before get our one last uh, shrimp scampi in. Just the hubby and I. And then we're going to get out of here. Uh, come back here and record so I can um, do nothing tomorrow but just relax and edit. And then we'll start again on the patio Monday. So I love y'all. And I hope that you are having a blessed, amazing fabulous fantastic day i hope you are praying for me as i always pray for you i speak life over us i speak joy i speak peace and most of all i speak just happiness sheer happiness it's going to be a great summer i'm excited for everything that's happening in my life and i pray the same for you so let's go get cute y'all i ain't been cute since last weekend and don't get me wrong, I wear my workout clothes. That's the, you know, I'm, I still go to work, so I got to wear that attire. But I love Saturdays and Sundays because I get to put clothes on. Um, so let's go get cute. Um, I'm going to wear that, this gorgeous jacket that I showed you guys in my last haul. It's cold here. It's 50 degrees here. Can somebody tell me why? Send me some sunshine if you got something, send me. Uh, and prayers go out. I have family in Texas, in Houston, and we had quite a few tragedies in Houston because of the weather. So we are sending grace, Lord's grace and mercy to Texas uh, in the Houston area. All my family members, thank God, everybody I texted and made sure and called, everybody's okay. Y'all be safe out there in them streets. Um, so we finna go out and creep real slow, get a, a little bit of shrimp scampi, and then come on back and be still somewhere. So I'ma throw in a cute, those cute pair of jeans um, that I showed in the video, but I'm gonna wear that striped shirt with that. We just gonna do all the patterns today. But I wanted to wear this jacket cause it's cold. And I, uh, I'm going to wear those shoes that match. So I'll show you guys the outfit of the day when I'm done. But I need to go get cute because I don't. Oh, I look like a wild woman. A real wild woman. Wild woman. Wild woman. Mm, mm, mm. Let's go. All right. So we are back. We are dressed. I'm going to show you the outfit of the day. But I wanted to come and finish getting dressed. And show you some of my jewelry. Of course, you guys have seen these bangles that I collected recently from the thrift store. I think I paid 99 cents for this one, $2 for this one, and $2 for this one. This watch was, let me turn the light down a little bit. This watch was, ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay. Um, I thrifted this a long time ago um, for like 2 or $3. But I'm trying to clean my glasses. Because I had on some orange ones. I'll show you the orange ones. But I had these on. But they're clashing with this flower. And that's bothering me. That's too much orange. So we're going to swap these out. And we're going to put on some brown. And I don't know what I got on these glasses that keep... I've had some type of oil. It must be lotion because I got lotion on my hands. But these feel better because they go better with the shirt. Is that better, y'all? Let me know. But I think this one is better. It doesn't clash with the um, the orange. It kind of tones it down a little bit. But I love the oversizedness. But this is that crop shirt that I showed you guys Um about a week or so ago in that haul but i am wearing a jacket because it is in the 50s here but we're gonna praise the lord we're gonna enjoy this day and we ain't gonna complain that's why we went out there and got to work anyway so my belt let me get my belt but like i said we're gonna go to red lobster because somebody is fiending and mad that they're closing red lobster already um matter of fact 
I need to these pants. Please forgive me, but these pants are a little too big in my waistline. Can you see this? See that? See how big? My waistline has always been smaller um, than, than anything. I don't care how much weight, I, whatever weight I was, my waistline always played games with me. So I'm going to pin it and then put a belt on for now. And I said I was going to sew these pants up this week, but I've been so busy with my patio that I have done nothing else that I needed to get done. Um, girl, what in the world? I'm going to have to get a bigger, a bigger um, pen. I'm trying to use this little bitty pen, but let me get a, a bigger pen and then I'll show you guys the complete outfit of the day. And then we're going to get out of here because I'm hungry. No, by y'all, but I'm hungry. All right. So this is the complete outfit of the day. Um, I just threw this on for the day. It's kind of chilly out. It's been raining all day. It's going to rain all day tomorrow. But I threw on these wide leg jeans that I showed you guys in that video since I hadn't had a chance to wear them yet. Um, and I threw this on with that those brown and white and orange wedges super high wedges thank god they are super high or else my pants would be like literally dragon dragon on the floor but these make it to where they touch but they are not quite dragging so i put on my belt and this is the gold belt here and this is the belt my girl Mary gave us um, when I was at her house. But this is the complete outfit of the day. Okay, babe. Um, but we're going to throw on my jacket right there when it's time to go. And then I'll see you guys when we get to getting something to eat. All right. Love y'all. Y'all, look at my baby. My baby's still a gentleman. He's just wet, so I just love it. He don't want me to get wet. Puddles everywhere. Ain't he handsome? Yeah. Say hey, Daddy. I hate the rain. <laughs> Y'all see my handsome face? We finally back on our date. We've been so busy. We've been so busy. We ain't been on a date in two weeks. We finally going out on a date. Ain't he handsome, y'all? Look how handsome. All right, I'm hungry. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, you guys. I love you today. I love you. I love you. I love you this morning. Listen. I just wanted to come this morning because I am filled with just, I don't know, I just wake up feeling such joy and wanted to share um, just a word of peace and positivity with you this morning. God loves you, baby. Listen, if you are alive and watching this right now, that means he chose you for another day to do it all of over again but do it with joy do it with jo choose happiness i know it's hard i know it's hard for me but i i'm i'm teach yourself you can always learn something new you ain't never too old to learn something new so we're going to start practicing choosing happiness we know it ain't easy. It's not easy. It ain't supposed to be. Because if it was, everybody would be doing it. So we're going to start together as a channel. A family. We choosing happiness. Good morning. We happy this morning. Good afternoon. We happy this evening. If this is when you are watching it. Good, good night. If you watching this before you go to bed. We love you. We choosing from here on out. It's joy. 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 God's great joy. 
I know it's that morning voice, but we're going to choose joy. Hello, hello, hello. I know sometimes you don't want to hear that, but it is what you need. Happiness is good for the soul. So we're going to start implementing it no matter what. Putting our foot down. We ain't taking no for an answer. It is joy. So we starting with, I love you. Let me hear you. I love you this morning. Yes. Uh-huh. So we're getting ready to go to the gym. I'm about to make my oatmeal. But I'm going to show you guys the outfit of the day. You know what I'm saying? I'm making my hair as big as I possibly can. Because uh, I am a diva. I'm a diva. I'm, I'm a diva. Hey. Uh-huh. Not, not, not deeper is up in, uh, that's what we're doing. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to come back. It's raining again, but it's all right. Cause we choosing what joy. So we're going to enjoy this day. Probably going to take her to the wreck today just to get out of this weather. Um, and then, uh, come home and I got to put my curtains, my curtains up. So. I love y'all, and I'll see y'all you guys in a minute. Let me go make my oatmeal. But Shout you know, out to New York Knicks. <laughs> he talking about the New York Knicks. But I love y'all, and I'll see you guys shortly. Come on, we choose a joy today, no matter what nobody say. Make up your own song. Mm -hmm. We choose a joy today, no matter what nobody say. You're stupid. <laughs> Look there, you supposed to be helping. <laughs> Look, <laughs> I'm putting my curtains up. Uh, oh Lord, I hope y'all can hear me. I'm putting my curtains up, and I'm out here trying to work, and somebody out here dancing. <laughs> but they coming out nice. These are the pieces that we use to hook the curtains outside. All right, you guys, as you could already see, I'm working on my curtains. They look fabulous. I ordered the wrong panels. I actually ordered, thought I ordered eight panels, but I only ordered four. So I have to go to the store and get two more panels. But they come, they came out really good because they're wider than what I thought. Um, but I have a pro tip for you. If you have um, any type of curtain that you don't want blowing in the wind every time the wind blows, and it has this, let's see, let me see if I can get it for you. If it has this, see that, that one inch seam at the bottom. If you have that problem and, and every time you turn around, the curtains are moving because of the wind blowing, or if you, um, even in the house, if you want to keep them still, I put pennies in the bottom or quarters and nickels. I prefer pennies cause I'm not using them. Um, so I'm gonna, I always put pennies in the bottom. I'll show you guys in a minute, I'll turn the camera around. But if you put pennies in the bottom, it'll weigh it down. So it's not just gonna move every time the wind blows. So I'll show you guys in a second what I'm talking about. Um, but just wanted to throw out that tip just in case it might help somebody. So let me finish working and I'll see you guys in a second. And the pennies are just going to roll at the bottom. Nobody's gonna, pay attention to those pennies in there unless they just bored and they pay, you know but it weighs it down and it'll keep it see how this one is blowing there are no pennies in that one so once i put the pennies in it will stay flush to the window it will blow if a really bad wind blows of course but this will help to keep that from moving every time see how this one is not moving but this one is because the wind is still blowing a little. So I'm going to put a couple more pennies in this one. And then I'm going to put pennies in these last two. And then I'll be done. It's still coming together. It's still all things are still kind of displaced. But they're coming together. I can't wait till you guys see it. But the curtains look nice. If you have any questions, make sure you leave them in the comment section. And you know I got you. Hi, you guys. Today is Wednesday. I'm sorry I'm just getting back to y'all, but I had a freak accident yesterday. I had an allergic reaction to something, and I have no idea what it was. I have an idea of what it was, but I had to go to the emergency room and get a couple of shots because I started swelling. It was terrible. But God, so I'm so sorry I didn't get to finish filming 
what I was working on in the patio because that's where it happened. Um, but this is going to be the end of the vlog. I'm so sorry. I really am about, I was trying to record or getting the footage of me finishing up and recording me putting up the curtains, but I touched something in the backyard or they're not sure if something bit me or if I ate something I was allergic to, but I feel so much better now. Um, but I do want to apologize for not being so fun in this last piece of the vlog, but I needed to get some rest. I just, I'm off for the rest of the week and I rest been resting. Um, and this happened yesterday. So 24 hours later, look at me. God is amazing. Everything is fine. Um, whatever it was, the medicine worked perfectly. So I will be on a uh, steroid for the next 10 days. So keep me in your prayers because God has me covered. But your prayers are always wonderful. So I love y'all. I hope you enjoyed the other portion of the vlog. I hope you enjoyed that. But I'm still working. I'm going to rest up today and tomorrow. And then Friday, I'm going to hit it again. Um, but tomorrow, I am going to go out and about because I do want to get out and get some fresh air. But I think I want to go to the hair store and um, get some new clip-ins. And I want to go get... I'll take a look at my favorite stores over there in that area in Norfolk where I always take you guys. Um, what's the name of that store? It'll come to me, but I'll take you guys tomorrow. So that will be a new day in the vlog. So make sure you're keeping up, but we're not going to do our usual thrift tomorrow. We're going to hang out with the hubby and keep it light tomorrow because I don't need to be doing too much. And then tomorrow I'm going to come home and rest. And then Friday we're going to hit that patio again running because I don't have a lot left to do. But it's so beautiful back there. Um, I'm still uh, in awe of God's presence back there. So I'm so grateful. that. But whatever it is, it it, it just slowed me down. And that, that wasn't number God saying I needed to sit on the rest somewhere. I ain't even turned the, the light on to record. This is just me showing you guys I'm okay and everything is good. But I love you. Hope you had an amazing week. This is going to be the finish of the vlog but i will pick you guys back up bright and shiny in the morning uh all duty up but we need some new clip-ins but i want to try a different pattern so i'm going to take you guys to the hair store show you the different patterns and then i'm gonna pick one because i got to do something to my head this weekend i got to feel like myself and i ain't used to doing three weeks with a hairstyle unless it's braids now braids you're gonna get about a month from me because i can do different hairstyles within braids so Y'all come with me tomorrow. Let's get some rest today. Wherever you are, listen to your body. But that rest felt so good. Y'all know I've been saying that in the last couple of weeks. I needed to rest. But that wasn't nothing God, but God saying, I need you to sit down somewhere and be still. And I kept saying, I just need to finish my patio, Lord. <clears throat> but I'm so grateful and thankful that it was nothing major. It was just something <clears throat> that God said, okay, I need you to get some sleep. And I did. It felt so good. Um, so I'm gonna rest up tomorrow um, and go hang out with the hubby. He gonna get a haircut and I'm gonna go shopping. And then we're gonna come home and chill. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. I love you. Keep your hands on me. Anytime you think of me, pray for me. That's what I tell y'all. Cause when I think of y'all, I pray for you. So remember that if you love somebody, when you think of them out of the blue, send a prayer up. God loves to hear from you. So have a wonderful day. I love y'all and thank you for stopping by Big Chick Vlogs. And I'll see y'all in the morning. Bright, fresh, and early, honey. I look real pajama-ish. Me and Wonder Woman. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So I'll see y'all later. Bye. I got some sunshine. See that vitamin D? You got to get that vitamin D in, honey. That, oh, that glow is gorgeous in the dark. Mm-hmm. Bye, y'all.